Princess Eugenie of York and her husband Jack Brooksbank, an ambassador for the tequila brand Casamigos in Britain, were together for about seven years before getting married. But they kept most of their relationship out of the public eye and mostly continued to do so after their royal wedding, except for important announcements, such as the birth of their second child. Here's what you need to know about Princess Eugenie and Jack Brooksbank's love story. They first met in Berbier, Switzerland. According to the BBC, the happy couple first met in 2010 in Verbier, a Swiss resort and ski resort, when Princess Eugenie was 20 and Brooksbank was 24. Verbier is a popular holiday destination for members of the royal family, and Eugenie vacationed there for many years with her mother, the Duchess of York, and her sister, Princess Beatrice. Eugenie's parents, the divorced Duke and Duchess of York, eventually bought a chalet there in 2015. Jack and Eugenia are actually distant relatives. It recently emerged that they are distant cousins, as are Eugenie's grandmother, Queen Elizabeth II, and her husband, Prince Philip. The duo first visited Royal Ascot together in 2011. In one of their first appearances as a couple, Brooksbank and Eugenie attended the annual horse race in 2011, shortly after they began dating. However, Kate Middleton reportedly wasn't invited to Ascot until her wedding in 2011 to Eugenie's cousin, Prince William. This is probably due to the fact that Eugenie is not a member of the royal family, and so she has fewer rules to follow. This is why Princess Eugenie is one of the few members of the British family to have an Instagram account. They were at a distance while Eugenia lived in New York. In 2013, Eugenia left London for New York, where she worked for the online auction house Paddle 8. Later that year, Brooksbank was interviewed by the Daily Mail in his first interview, in which he talked about how the couple was going through a breakup. We spend a lot of time on Skype, he said. It's great. We're still very much together. Eugenia returned to London in 2015. Eugenia returned to London in 2015, and the couple began spending more time together. In 2016, Eugenia shared with Harper's Bazaar what their home life is like. When I'm with Jack, we watch The Walking Dead, which we're obsessed with, she said. Maybe Game of Thrones is our next thing. I don't watch reality TV, but I love cooking shows. In the same interview, Eugenia shared that her boyfriend and her dog have the same name which she said was a complete coincidence. The following year, they celebrated a milestone in their relationship. In September 2016, the couple joined the Queen and other members of the royal family for a weekend at Balmoral, the Queen's Scottish residence, sparking rumors of an engagement. Eugenie's cousin, Prince Harry, threw a shooting party at the castle to celebrate his 32nd birthday, and an insider told the Daily Express, you could call this weekend a rite of passage for Jack. There's no way he'll be invited to stay with the Queen unless he's been accepted into the royal fold and into the family fold. They attended Pippa Middleton's wedding together. In May 2017, Eugenie and Brooksbank attended the wedding of Pippa Middleton and James Matthews. Eugenie wore a stunning Paul Ka gown, while Brooksbank opted for a traditional trench coat. Brooksbank proposed to Eugenie in Nicaragua in January 2018. In a video posted on the royal family's YouTube account, Brooksbank described the setting on that day when he got down on one knee as a beautiful volcano, a summer setting, birds flying. Eugenia also talked about the surprise engagement. The lake was so beautiful. The light was just special, which I had never seen before, she said. I actually said it was an incredible moment, and then he popped the question, which was really amazing, even though we had been together seven years. I was over the moon. The royal family responded to the engagement with well wishes. On January 22, 2018, the royal family's official Twitter account announced the engagement, stating, The Duke and Duchess of York are pleased to announce the engagement of Princess Eugenie to Jack Brooksbank. Eugenia's mother also tweeted her good wishes, simply stating, Total joy. Their engagement photo shoot followed immediately after the engagement announcement. 
The couple posed for a series of portraits taken at Buckingham Palace shortly after they announced their engagement, where the princess showed off her engagement ring. The ring is set with a paparazzka sapphire surrounded by diamonds and is very similar to the ring her father, Prince Andrew, proposed to her mother. In an interview about their upcoming wedding, Brooks Bank said the Queen wished us all the best, which was amazing, it was really nice that she was so happy for us. They made their first official royal appearance together on Easter Sunday. Three months after announcing their engagement, the couple went to a church service on Easter Sunday at St. George's Chapel at Windsor Castle, where their wedding was also taking place. It was their first official appearance together at a royal event. They also attended Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's wedding. Just a month later, in May 2018, Eugenia and Brooks Bank went to another event at St. George's Chapel. This time it was Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's wedding. Eugenie wore a light blue dress with a pale hat, while Brooks Bank chose a dark suit with a blue tie to match his bride. Eugenia and Brooks Bank lived next door to the newly minted Duke and Duchess before Meghan and Harry moved to California. They kicked off the summer at the Serpentine Summer Party. Just four months before the big day, the couple attended the Serpentine Summer Party, an annual evening hosted by Chanel. Eugenie looked radiant in a patterned one-shoulder tunic over black leggings, and Brooks Bank was in a navy blue suit with a yellow tie. And he even showed a little PDA at Charlie Van Starbenzi and Daisy Jenks' wedding. They were married at St. George's Chapel on October 12, 2018. Eugenia wore a Peter Pilato and Christopher DeVos dress, adorned with an emerald tiara she borrowed from the Queen, and no veil. Although the wedding day was a little windy, before the wedding there was a beautiful rainbow over the chapel. The royal couple announced in September 2020 that Eugenie was expecting her first child. Her Royal Highness Princess Eugenie and Mr. Jack Brooksbank are very pleased to announce that they are expecting a child in early 2021. Buckingham Palace said in an official statement. The Duke of York and Sarah, Duchess of York, Mr. and Mrs. George Brooksbank, the Queen and the Duke of Edinburgh are thrilled with the news. Eugenie celebrated the announcement by posting a cute photo of the baby slippers on Instagram. Jack and I are so excited to start 2021, she wrote in the caption. Their baby boy was born on February 9, 2021. Princess Eugenie gave birth to the couple's firstborn at London's Portland Hospital. Her Royal Highness Princess Eugenie gave birth safely to a son today, February 9, 2021, at 8.55 at Portland Hospital. Jack Brooksbank was present, the royal family said in a statement. The princess shared her excitement in a cute Instagram post showing her and Jack holding the hand of their newborn. They later announced that their son's name is August Philip Hawk Brooksbank. Their second child was born on May 30, 2023. Princess Eugenie and Jack welcomed their second child, a son named Ernest George Ronnie Brooksbank, in May 2023. We are pleased to share a small announcement, Buckingham Palace announced nearly a week later. Princess Eugenie and Mr. Jack Brooksbank are pleased to announce the safe birth of their son, Ernest George Ronnie Brooksbank. Ernest was born on Tuesday, May 30, and weighed 7 pounds 1 ounce. Princess Eugenia wrote that Ernest was named after his great-great-great-grandfather George, his grandfather George, and my grandfather Ronald. Eugenia often shares cute pictures of Jack on her Instagram account.